What's up guys, Rogue9 here, and let me start off by saying a big thank you to everyone who commented on my last video, raising some additional questions about Hibana's ex Kairos. In this video, I'll be answering just those questions, so let's get straight to it. The first question that was quite rightfully raised is, how does the ex Kairos perform against Jaeger's ADS? And the answer to that question is, yes, Jaeger's ADS does target the ex Kairos pellets, but each single ADS only has two charges. So in order to stop a single six pellet shot from the ex Kairos, you need all three of Jaeger's ADS to work together. The next obvious question is, what about that other German fellow, Bandit? First of all, let's see what happens when you fire the Kairos pellets at an electrified reinforced wall. And as was to be expected, they are immediately destroyed. So what happens if you shoot the pellets at a reinforced wall and then Bandit puts down his battery? Uh, yes, I'm going to call him Bandit from now on. So that's the breaching pellets attached. Battery going up. And they're gone. Makes sense, I guess. But what happens if we fire the pellets at the wall and then trigger them and try to put down a battery once they're triggered? Go ahead. That's attached. And that's a clear no. Attaching a battery to a reinforced wall after the pellets have been triggered will not destroy them. And the last, and maybe in this case actually least interesting point I want to check out is what happens to the Kairos pellets if you try to shoot through electrified wire? This might be a fairly unlikely scenario, but maybe you're in such a rush that you can't take out a normal gun and shoot the battery first and you really just have to shoot through the wire right now. And also maybe you only have one charge of your Kairos left, so you have to go at floor level to be able to crawl through. Yeah, that sounds fairly stupid, doesn't it? But nevertheless, the question remains what happens if you shoot the Kairos at electrified barbed wire? And the answer is... Yep, the pellets are destroyed. If, on the other hand, the electrified wire is on the other side of a breachable surface, just like, for instance, this ceiling hatch, then your ex Kairos pellets will be absolutely fine, as is to be expected. I suppose that kind of makes sense. And as you would also expect, detonating the pellets will destroy both the barbed wire and the battery at the same time. And there you have it, irrefutable evidence of how the ex Kairos can and can't be defeated by the German Defender gadgets. Many thanks again to everyone who commented on the last video, both raising these questions and providing some of the answers straight up. If you have any more comments or questions about the ex Kairos or the game in general, feel free to post them below. And with that, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next episode.